Oh, Here. It is. Both of you guys, what, got fevers or something? Well, we're gonna go get medicine. No. You like medicine. Oh, yeah. See? Okay, good morning, aloha kakayaka. Um, so last night, Paulele, like when I brought her, we like the kids fall asleep in the living room and we just carry them into their rooms. And in our case, or in Paulella's case, I mean, she goes into our room because she stays in our room. And when I was carrying her in to our room last night to go in her bed, um, she felt really warm. Like, I know she had a fever. And then later on, early in the morning, at about like one o'clock, that's when she felt really hot. Like her face was like almost flushed with like, it was like pinkish, reddish. So she was like really hot. And I don't know where our freaking ear thermometer is or like whatever. So we just ran out of baby Tylenol too. Yeah, so we gotta go to the store. I gotta go get eggs. It's Easter weekend. She's like so sad looking. Bloku, okay, you need to pick up all of these magnetic tile thingies. Why are you crying? Oh, look at the face. Why are you crying for? I want to go at Target. No, we're not going to go all the way downtown. No, I'm Target. No, Kiaha. Canyon medicine and medicine drinks. Medicine drinks. Or we can have the medicine right now, the other ones. You're so weird. Okay, let's go. Come on. Wow. Change your lole. Okay, so we're gonna go to the store. Have no makeup on. Cause we're just gonna go to the store. Come back. You ready to go to the store, Tita? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Eh. Eh. Hi. <laughs> Hi. She took it out from the house. Give it. Don't. I took it out from the house. Okay, never mind. You can have it already. She keeps throwing it down. <laughs> the mo. -o. It's peeking its little head out. The wheels Mom, on Tabasco round. Um, Guess how much the chicken wire? I was gonna buy chicken wire to like hang my glasses on, and look how much they are. It's twenty three dollars, like for the cheapest one, and these are like sixteen. On these, these are perfect. What I've been looking for, two dollars and fifty cents each, and I got like the little mounts for it. And the reason why I was gonna get chicken wire is to do the exact same thing. I was gonna for this so I'm so happy. Remember Paulele was crying earlier this morning and I thought it was because she wasn't feeling well but I'm pretty sure it's because she does not like the movie Wally. -E. Every time she sees like the white robot whatever her name is she starts to cry like full on like her face is so sad like let's see if this works yeah let's see oh there's the white robot there's Evie. Let's see what her face looks like. Kia hi, Hanoi. What are you doing?
She's crying. Oh Why are you? I'm changing this. Okay, I'm changing it. Oh my gosh. Was right when I turned it, she's already happy. You like? These movies, yeah, but not Wally. Oh my gosh. I don't know if it's like sad music. She's very emotional. TV is pretty dirty. I did not realize that until looking at the screen on the camera. She's gonna start dancing. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh, excuse the no makeup look, but yeah, she's pretty emotional. I, um, we were watching Good Dinosaur one time, and we were in the car, so she was watching the whole movie on her iPad, and she started to cry just like that, like, you know, like, ooh, like her eyes was all red and watery, and her frown was like, it was just so sad, like such a sad face, and I was telling um, Paula, and I was like, is this a sad part of the movie or something? Like, why is she crying? Did she get hurt? Um, I was like, or is this the sad part of the movie? And then she told me, yeah, it's the part where Arlo has to leave Spot. So she was full on crying, like she's super emotional. Like, so I don't know if Wally, the song, or the soundtrack of it, because you know, it's like very like, kind of sad if you think about it. Like the vibe you get off of it, Wally, it's like a sad movie. And I think she just got that vibe and she just doesn't like the songs. Hey everyone, okay, so it's like really later now and I think it's like 8 o'clock. Don't I look like I'm so sweaty, like I just got finished working out, you know, a towel around my neck. No, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't get finished working out or nothing. <laughs> I'm actually marinating um, some coconut oil in my hair and it's dripping all over me so I always have to put like a towel right here but I always look like, it always looks like I just got finished working out because I have like the towel around my neck and like my face is like, looks like it's sweating because of the oil and my hair obviously looks like it's like sweating. I like to do this once a week. I put organic coconut oil um, mainly at the end. What are they laughing about over there? Anyway, I mainly put them um, at the end of my hair because that's like the most, like the part of my hair that it needs it the most. So that's what I do. And then I put it underneath my hair because that's like the most frizziest. And even over here, like all these, kind of like letting it soak up. And then I'm going to go shower soon. And then um, I just made, me and Darren, like half the box of like the organic Annie's pasta. And this is the Parmesan flavor one really good um but i add like garlic salt because it makes it taste like way better i swear and then this is just my starbucks cup and i just put in some of that metagold um iced tea um today's good friday yeah sorry i'm just looking at how like weird i look like this so um today is good friday and we forgot that on good friday you don't eat meat, you can't eat meat. Um, so that's why we just had salad and some pasta tonight and not nothing with meat in it. Um, we forgot this morning and we actually did eat meat at Ina Loco Moco as you watch the beginning. And Darren had like some chicken or something and the kids had moose bees, so that was a fell on us. So the kids had macaroni and cheese and then yeah, this is our dinner. So 